Welcome back to another episode of the Shade TV. My name is Marissa Hill, and today we're gonna to be taking a look at the dazzling blue Yeezy 350s. So let's take a quick sneak peek. Welcome back to another unboxing and review. If you're new to the channel, welcome. Be sure to hit that subscribe right now if you're not already. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up and feel free to leave me any comments or questions you may have down below. Hit that notification bell because we do have a ton of heat coming out that I don't want you to miss out on. Also, be sure to check out that join button for all of our amazing membership perks as well as our merch store. As mentioned earlier, we're gonna be talking about the Yeezy 350 V2 silhouette in the dazzling blue colorway. This is such a crisp, sharp color. I was super excited when I saw early looks on this. So very excited to show you what these look like in hand. First, we'll start off with the overview, then talk about size and fit, followed by how I styled these, and then we'll conclude with how these are currently doing on the resale market. So let's jump right into it. So starting with the prime net side panels, you'll notice that we do have that dazzling blue, which really pops quite nicely off of the black. I do love a good solid black base for my sneakers just because they do tend to get dirty sometimes. And this is definitely a shoe that's not gonna get so dirty because of the black profile that we've got going on as the base. So the prime knit is then kind of spackled with that dazzling blue throughout the side. We do have that scripture as well on top in the black colorway. As we work our way to the back, you'll notice that it does kind of edge off into more of a spackled uh, dotted effect on the inner side profile of the sneaker. We do have simplistic black laces. Now let's look on the inside of the shoe. So we do have dazzling blue for the Yeezy script as well as logo and the Adidas logo on the other side of the insole and that is on top of just a simplistic black insole. Then the base is kind of a translucent darker charcoal gray color scheme and you can see the boost underneath there. That'll complete the shoe. Let's take a look at all those details. All right, so as far as size and fit on these, I would highly, highly recommend going minimum half a size up. I personally think I'm gonna start going about a full size up just because I feel like my toes have been feeling a little bit more on the cramped side on the toe box. The prime net is quite tight on these, so definitely, definitely take that into consideration as your heel will push up and it will kind of cramp your toes in that toe box region that is quite narrow. All right, now let's move into styling. So as you noticed, I am not at home right now. So definitely had some fun shooting in Florida with my different looks. So for the first look, I decided to wear really just a vibrant blue dress that I feel like matched the dazzling blue to a T and that's for a more dressed up look. Yeah, I feel like I'm at the tippy top of my game, looking down at the rafters. I had the sun these 
boys, can't leave them bastards A lot of dudes, just some undercover actress I don't fall for it, I'm perfect to all your tactics Yeah, so try again, it's time to take a vitamin Yeah, and vitamin, welcome to the lion's den And I'm Mufasa, big boss in charge of Coming in like a bull, you see me raising the stock up uh, yeah. So baby, you gonna need some patience I already won, now I'm just making a statement Uh Damn, baby, why your mans keep hating? You asking about the cake, you here for the celebrations? For the second look, I decided to keep it pretty casual with this kind of tie-dyed shirt. And it has some nice blue hues that I think really accented the sneakers quite nicely. And then I pair that with some nice, just wide-legged denim and a light color scheme. <laughs> I know they all wish I'd take away they made it, but sorry I'm taking me and my lady mating. She look me in the eyes and tell me how much she loving on my uh, confidence. Yeah, it really shouldn't be no arguments. Cause you're now viewing the greatest of all time. Saying I can't get better. I promise they all lying on my confidence. Yeah, that's right. Uh look. And for the last and final look, I wore just a simple dazzling blue colors, colored uh, sweater, which I paired with some simple black shorts. My brain move a little faster than others, yeah. I even keep a close eye on my brothers. Cause sometimes it's your blood that turn into blood suckers, yeah. Ooh. And I'm on a big mission. My old team got a plate up in the kitchen, yeah. I'm talking everything. I make all the fixes, yeah. They come a long way from where they come up missing. I blame it on my confidence, yeah. Promise I'm really this astonishing. And yeah, you're now viewing. You let me know down below what was your favorite look out of the three, or how would you style these? that make my mind scared hold me hostage and they don't fight fair who gon' pray for me and wipe on my tears who gon' save me if you not right here move this darkness and make my sight clear take me your way cause i don't like here ghost of my past they fill in the night air wake me up i'm trapped in my nightmares Of all my demons, all my thoughts are committing treason All alone, who gon' hear me screaming? Ah! Manifestations of my fears Regrets that stretched out for light years Can almost touch the light, homie, it's right there Body free but trapped in my nightmares Wake me up, don't let me drown All the lights are fading now All my life is fading now All my life is fading now conclude with how these are currently doing on the resale market. These currently retail at 220 and on the resale market, these are going between 300 to 400 dollars. All right, that's it for this unboxing and review. If you're new here today, thanks for joining us. Be sure to hit that subscribe right now. If you haven't already, give this video a thumbs up. Feel free to leave any comments or questions down below. And again, be sure to hit that notification bell because we have a ton of heat coming out that they don't want you to miss out on. Also, if you click that join button, we do have some amazing membership perks on there as well as an amazing merch store. This is Shade TV. My name is Marissa Hill. We will catch you all on the next episode. Uh, uh.